Hey everyone, my name is Kumo and this is my reaction to the first episode of Citrus. So, I mentioned in my what I'm going to watch this season video that I wasn't sure if I was going to react to this one or not because I have read some of the manga which obviously makes this less of a blind reaction than it otherwise would be. And I'm not the biggest fan of, well, not the biggest, not the biggest fan, I'm not great at reacting to melodrama. I don't remember a huge amount from the manga, all I really remember is that Yuzu and May had a very complicated relationship and a certain kiss scene that's probably going to be in this first episode that I was not was not a big fan of but that's honestly about all I really remember from the manga so but since I do love Yuri so much I thought I would at least react to the first episode if people want me to react to more they can let me know in the comment section but yeah I'll do at least one episode so let's get into it let us begin in three two one play Uh. <laughs> yeah, we'll see how that goes. <laughs> yeah, Yuzu the gal. <laughs> I bet you will. Not a big fan of the school uniform. But yeah, Citrus, pretty apt title for the anime for the the IP in general. <laughs> Don't stab yourself. Can't hold in. They've already gone that far. Jeez. <laughs> I like the transition from the hand holding to that. <laughs> but basically saying, hey, this is what hand holding leads to. Not a bad opening. Definitely some nice parts here and there. Oh man, hand holding in public. I knew some of the girls in this were lewd, but... <laughs> wow. You know... At the end of the day, this still has... <laughs> cute girls kissing, so... I'm obviously going to enjoy it. It's quite a room. Yeah, it sure is fun. If only we could have seen it from step one to the end result. <laughs> Something's missing. <laughs> For a second I thought that was uh, something else. Ah, uh, makeup. That's what I was missing. I looked far too much like a standard high school girl before. And there you go. I'm sure nobody at school will complain about your new attire. Yeah, literally nothing else. <laughs> Even has a little drying on it. It's adorable. <laughs> it's cute that she calls him Mama and Papa. And more importantly, a new sister.
<laughs> yeah, though this you know, this school is a bit more strict than her past one. <coughs> Just a bit. So she kind of stands out like a sore thumb. <laughs> hey, that makes it better. I don't know what you're on about. You can have plenty of fun with girls, as I'm sure you'll find out soon enough. <laughs> well, it's the first time for everything. <laughs> uh... Well, you admitted to everyone watching this, so hate to break it to you. Could you please dress like a normal student? <laughs> well, I don't see what the problem is. Okay, that's a bit too far. You need a cell phone in this day and age. <laughs> Yeah, it's not like there's any kind of handbook or anything I could have read. <laughs> Doing. <laughs> uh, what? <laughs> uh. So basically, she's checking her out, <laughs> making a scene, user. <laughs> she goes in the offensive. She's like, I don't make the rules. Don't yell at me. And here she is. Delayed on the law. Rules can still go too far. But she's too captivated by her beauty to really pay attention to what she's saying. Not that I blame her. Fight, 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 kiss, kiss, kiss. <laughs> Actually, look like she was going for a kiss there. Of course, she looks like she just given the kiss altogether and going for it. <laughs> uh, I'm pretty sure that's got to violate a rule or two <laughs> or three and violate a yuzu. <laughs> I know, right? You just met. But yeah, anime girls really don't need makeup, so you're fine. <laughs> uh, how can people possibly survive without makeup? <laughs> yeah, that was the important thing there. So I can buy the same one and smell like her. Get out of here. <laughs> yeah, you don't want to forget that I was actually about to say something. <laughs> Yeah, it's pretty cool looking school. I especially like the glass ceiling there. We don't need any more any more of that. <laughs> the giant you. And this is, of course a giant zoo to match. And naturally she's gonna be in our class. She 
she really <laughs> needs to... She's clearly having a rough time adjusting to this new culture. For lack of a better word. <laughs> uh, yeah, they're very different than you, Yuzu. <laughs> Who are you again? How do you mean? Well, you came out a little bit too strong for one. The good old escalator system. So many 3D CG students. But yeah, she's probably only a Gyaru there. Yeah, very nervous about breaking rules. <laughs> yeah, she's an exception, all right. And she is gorgeous, like, there's no joke about that. Don't remind me about that. Uh, I'm sure you'll make your life more interesting, Yuzu. <laughs> well, you gotta be careful about, uh, hiding it. <laughs> I have no pocket for it. Uh... Just smile and nod your head. Yeah, I think she is one with a dressing problem. Yes, I'm totally paying attention. And what is that outfit? And does she realize she has a mushroom on her head? Uh, I know, right? At least he got it back. And it should have a uh, May smell on it, so. I mean, you could probably improvise, find a different place for it. It might be a bit awkward when it vibrates, but. <laughs> and that was amazing. I blink, almost blinked and missed it, but I think she tried to put it in her spot and then just nothing there, so it slid down. <sighs> yeah, this scene. I, I don't want to watch this scene. I'm sure Yuzu doesn't either. This is one of the few things I did remember about the manga. Because I could never forget this. <sighs> yeah, you were spotted. Pretty much my least favorite part of the manga. <laughs> she has more important thoughts on her mind now. <laughs> well, yes, but that wasn't the issue here. And that place is huge. Boxes. If you move, that's generally a thing you have to deal with. <laughs> How weak are you? <laughs> Here, let me handle it. 
<laughs> my new papa. <laughs> it's a funny way to refer to him. I'll be back eventually. <laughs> she wouldn't do something like that. <laughs> yes. More or less. Even has an elevator. Well, of course it has an elevator. That'd be a lot of flight of stairs if you lived on the top. <laughs> you know, it would be easier if you just move the boxes instead of having to walk around them. Yeah, the sister. Did she not tell you about her? <laughs> and there she is. <laughs> uh... Now give her a hug, and then a kiss, in that order. And then you can check for her phone. <laughs> they add an extra name to it. I live here now. You're gonna have to share your bed. It's probably gonna take a minute to process this. <laughs> I'm not sharing my mama with you. <laughs> it's too late, Yuzu. It's happened. I can barely hear you over the sizzling. But yeah, they live in a nice place. <laughs> uh, I never asked for this little sister. But I'm sure she'll break her in, nonetheless. <laughs> I'm armed. Yeah, that's the word for it. <laughs> uh. She's only taking like one bite. <laughs> and she's angry, so angry Aiden. Ah, the grandfather, yeah. Wow, that is rough. <laughs> well, she has you now, so no more being lonely. Yeah, it's an important detail. You might want to remember that, Yuzu. <laughs> oh, God. <laughs> oh, my God, Yuzu. <laughs> Bat scene? Bassin. It's gonna happen to be a May Bassin, but I'll take this. <laughs> Bathing in golden water. I mean, if your little sister's that cute, I'm just, I think you'll survive. Yes. Now just now you have to be the one to make her make those faces. <laughs> hey only one way to find out. Come here, May. Because you're in love. <laughs> I could probably write up a list. That's interesting. 
I guess the room's just like split down the middle for them. You could have taken one together. I mean, this bathtub is a little bit small, but I'm sure you can make it work. <laughs> uh, keep trying. You'll you'll get through it. <laughs> Even if that stuff didn't happen, it probably wouldn't go much better. <laughs> I know, right? How rude. Oh, is she going to bring that up? Yeah. I think she got a reaction out of her. Oh, jeez. <laughs> Not the usual reaction to that, but uh, I'll take it. And she'll definitely take it. And I'll watch her take it. <laughs> Close your eyes. You're too young for this. Poach. <laughs> it's pretty intense. Jeez, oh, man, I don't remember being that hot from the manga. Is it, uh, is it a little bit hot in here, or is it just me? <laughs> Wish the camera was a bit closer so you could see if there was a saliva trail. But yeah, you wanted a reaction from her, and you got it. I see. But I didn't quite get it, so let's try it one more time. A little bit longer this time. It's in less clothing. And man, Yuzu does look really good in that outfit, especially laying down like that. <laughs> hey, uh, hey, I wouldn't call that a disappointment. I'd say that was pretty good. <laughs> uh, having your first kiss stolen by your cute little sister. If you want, if you want to switch problems with me, only have to ask once. But yeah, that was a great way to end it off. Whew! I think I might need some water after that. <laughs> so cute with her teddy bear. And of course, used with her smartphone. I do like how Yuzu gets along with her mother really well. And I also like how she, you know, gets along with her sister. And some very nice shots in this ending. So that was the first episode of Citrus. The story pretty much about Yuzu, her mother getting, you know, remarried, and her having to move, transfer to a new school. That's very different from her old school, a lot more strict, and which is a thing she kind of had to learn the hard way. And she now has a new father, who I'm sure she'll meet eventually, and a new sister, who she met before realizing that she was her new sister, having a bit of trouble adjusting to that realization, and just having a gen... Difficulty in general getting her to warm up to her. 
Which, well, for a while, but after she pushed the right buttons and had made some very blackmailish statements, she she decided to try to warm up to her a little bit by showing her exactly what a kiss is like. So, you know, now use a nose. And that kissing scene was amazing. Just, that was very hot, very intense, very well done. Uh, I'm not going to talk about any other certain kisses that were much less enjoyable to watch. That that didn't happen. So, But in any case, yeah. I would say it was a pretty good adaptation of the of the manga so far. Most of what I remember from the manga was in this episode. Although this episode did kind of remind me of a certain cringy scene between the chairman and Yuzu. But in any case, thank you for watching. And thank you, Snoki, as well as everyone else, for doing what you can to support the channel. It means a lot to me, and I hope we can continue to grow the channel together. If you want to do more to support the channel, then you can become a patron on my Patreon and get cool rewards like early access to certain videos. Have a good one.